Hey, what's up everybody? Joshua Casper back at you with Plugin Boutique and welcome to the third and final video in the short video series we're making for Voltage Modular by Cherry Audio. Voltage Modular, I didn't set up a very simple drum patch here uh, using a sequencer and the console mixer and then we've ran some uh, effects sends over here, some delay and reverb, and then we've ran the output into some compressors and sent that compressor out to the main host. This video, we're going to use this oscillator right here. And if I go ahead and delete that, it should just show you how to get it over here. If I come over here and just type in OSC, and we're going to make a, a very simple bass line. Again, the aim of this video tutorial is for people, absolute beginners, getting started with the modular system, so it's not overwhelming, but you can get some sound and then move forward to more advanced stuff from there. So. I'm going to hit the oscillator button and I'm going to bring it down to its own rack uh, slot down here. And on top of that, we're going to need some other things to make the oscillator work and be able to sculpt it to make it sound, you know, kind of like you would get out of a VSTi synth or something like that. So I'm going to come in here and type filter. I'm going to type envelope and we're going to use envelope generator. I'm going to type in amplifier because we need to amplify the signal. And then I'm also going to type in compressor and distortion, just, you know, as a little bit of extra there at the end. And I'm going to put that before there. So the first thing we need to do is send noise from the oscillator into the filter. The oscillator is right now making noise. We just can't hear it because it's not connected to anything. So let's just go ahead and take, let's say, the square wave here and put audio in. Okay, and then what we need to do is amplify that signal. So we want to come in from whatever type of filter we want to use. So this is going to be for a baseline. So obviously the high cut is what we're going to want to use. And we want to go to CV or control voltage in on the amplifier. And what we're going to be using to trigger this sound is the drum trigger sequencer. And I know it says drum up there, but just for the sake of keeping things interesting and keeping things short and sweet, we're going to use it. So we're going to take the gate D and go to gate in on our envelope. And then what we need to do is take the envelope and send it into the amplifier, okay? So this is set up and ready to go. So if I take my output now and drag it onto channel four and go ahead and solo, let's solo uh, four here and play it. And then obviously let's bring up the release. So you can see how easy it is. Now, if we want to choose the different shape, we can do that here. We've got pulse width modulation control. We do have the range over here, so we can go really low if we wanted to, or actually quite high. Uh, we do have a frequency control, a plus or minus seven semitones, and so on and so forth. So we've got something cooking here, but I want to show you a little bit more of processing ability. So I'm going to take it out of four here, and I'm going to go into the distortion. And then I can go out of the distortion, I can either go right from the distortion into that channel, or I can go from the distortion to the compressor and then out of the compressor into that channel. And now if we run it, Boom, we got some stuff cooking. So hopefully by now you have a decent idea of what needs to be connected to what. You know, just follow around with these three videos and you'll have at least this going. Uh, the step sequencer is pretty straightforward. Um, hopefully now you can see that it's pretty easy just to go out, in, out, in, and then go to your mixer. When the mixer is connected to your output, you should be good to go. But I mean, once you get in and start using LFOs and modulators to really start moving the sound around, you can get some really cool results. So that was a very quick and dirty intro to Voltage Modular System by Cherry Audio. It's available now in Plugin Boutique. If you want to check it out, links in the video description. I'm Joshua Casper here, and I'll see you in the next video.